Hey folks, it's Troy Lucas uh, from Lucas Roasting Company and this Sunday we are taking you into the realm of what else you can do with your spent coffee grounds. Um, ours comes in the form of all of our espresso pucks um, from the cafe and yours might come from your coffee pot at home, separating the filter uh, from it and using it for um, fertilizer for certain plants. So we are looking at a uh, high bush blueberry that was here when we bought our house. And we have been um, over the winter time, um, just dumping grounds out on the ground, even in the snow. And uh, it's now settled in around on the grass. So we've got that high bush blueberry. We've got this high bush blueberry over here by the the woods and we just picked up uh, six more blueberry bushes from spiderweb gardens and uh, so now uh, this is this is what's left of what this week uh, we had at the very end of the week and we're going to start putting these down around the six blueberry bushes now the thing to do with this is to amend the soil around your plant but not necessarily put the the composted coffee grounds right up on the coffee plant. You don't necessarily want to do that. And that's true with a whole lot of uh, mulching of plants. So you keep the mulch back just a little bit, but we're just going to do uh, as much as we have today. We're just going to start to them in the soil around this. And so what you might not know, um, we're not going to get all of them today. We're just going to start. Um, what you might not know about coffee grounds is that Coffee grounds have um, a really good nitrogen, one, about 1% 1 nitrogen giving back into the, the soil. And um, blueberries, other uh, acidic plants uh, thrive on you know, acid soil. So um, this will break down, create an acidic environment around the plant, the root system. And then um, it will just feed the plant from the roots up. But again, you don't place it on the base of the, of the plant itself. You keep it out a little bit so it soaks down in with watering and with rains. So um, yeah, this is one of many uses for uh, your spent coffee grounds, uh, giving your coffee a little more life. Uh, we know coffee is expensive and uh, we know that if you can use it all the way up to uh, it's it's termination point to where it's no longer good for much of anything then you'll get the most bang for your buck. Hope this was informational for you